The head coach of the Buckeyes is joining us here. Ryan, always great to see you. Thanks for, thanks for doing this. I want to start. I know playoff expansion is not on your mind, but it called to mind something you said in the offseason about how 11 and 2, unacceptable here, playing for championships. In your mind, how does expansion more access perhaps alter the definition of what might be viewed as an acceptable seat? Well, I think it's exciting because, like you said, it's going to be a little different approach to things. So I think that now that uh, there's going to be an expansion in the playoffs, getting to the playoffs is very important, and playing your best football at the end of the season is going to be critically important, where now, I mean, you have to make sure you're on every single week. Coach, losing to, to the team up north last year, winning the Rose Bowl. Michigan. How did that, Michigan, <laughs> how did that project you into the offseason? And what, how would you estimate this team's hunger and desire to get to this day, to yeah. start of the 2022 season? Well, you know, going into the Rose Bowl, it was a challenge to get momentum into the offseason. And I think the way that we responded in the second half of the Rose Bowl says a lot about our team. And then, uh, you know, really that whole team is almost back. So, as we went into the offseason, spent a lot of time on leadership, did an unbelievable job in the preseason of building that leadership, and this team really came together. They had an edge all offseason, had a really good spring, had a really good preseason. Now it's time to go play. Coach, you, um, you brought on Jim Knowles as your defensive coordinator. Um, tell us more about, like, his philosophy and what type of um, progress you've seen from the defense under his leadership. Well, it started off just by the way he teaches, the way that he brings guys together. Uh, really great scheme, but, but really the guys on the whole defensive side of the ball are really exceptional. I, I think really when you combine the experience that we have coming back on defense, we had a really inexperienced defense with the new scheme and the new staff. Yep. It's exciting. And, and they've really been playing with great decisiveness on defense, running around with aggressiveness. It's going to be exciting to see them play tonight. Man, Can't you've wait. got so many weapons on this offense, and it turns out that Notre Dame put the face of one of those weapons, C.J. Stroud, on some blocking slides. What you, what you think of that? Well, I just think, <laughs> all, all I think about is this. I think about tonight and the expectation that, you know, you look at how many times you have an opportunity to go play in a situation like this. And I think yeah. that's where the focus is. And I think when you look at CJ and you talk about the way that he's really spent the time in this offseason focused on winning. It hasn't been about numbers. It hasn't been about Heisman Trophy. It hasn't been about yards. He wants to win. And that's the way the whole team is. And what a great opportunity right here. There's not very many times in your life where you get to play a top five game, the first game of the year, and the 100th year of the anniversary of the stadium uh, on ESPN, the whole thing. It's just going to be an exciting night. And I know our guys are ready to play. I, I know CJ gave $500 gift cards to make sure everybody looked fly in their suits on game day. How would you rank if the players rated your attire and how you dress? Would you be on the fly scale up there? <laughs> no, <laughs> a little bit different. My, a whole different style. I got a nice, sharp, nice coat. Yeah. I get some compliments, but a little different in the boys. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a little different. Different era. Yeah, you dress to your age. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Hey, you what, look good. You look good. What, message for the crowd tonight. I know you obviously want an advantage of playing in the shoe at oh. night. It's a special scene. They're already getting off to a big start. Well, they, yeah, they get, yeah, they get all day to get excited. <laughs> so, <laughs> What's uh, your message to the crowd tonight? I mean, driving in early this morning, seeing all the people already out here. What an unbelievable opportunity for Buckeye Nation to be together in the shoe. And the 100th year anniversary with this game, let's be the loudest it's ever been. When yeah. they have the ball, let's be loud. Let's show them what Buckeye Nation's all about. Yeah. I think they're eager to show Michael Mayer that yeah. this is not just any <laughs> other environment. Ryan, always great to see you, my friend. Good luck tonight nice and in all season. Ryan Day, head coach of the Buckeyes. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.